And now, another episode of Crit Camp Gaming. Oh man. Oh man. Oh We're man, oh back, man. boys. Oh it's been man, a week oh off. Man. All right, all right, all right. So all far. right, all right, all right. All right, all right. <laughs> I hope, is anybody playing as All Right, All Right, All Right tonight? Wait, is he a... He's one of the he dudes. Character? He's uh, from Zombieland. Um, no, 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 no. Yeah. Not, not Woody. Right? Yeah. McConaughey. Not Woody. Oh, wrong. Wrong thing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm being robbed right now. <laughs> oh, man. Yo, is, that, is that the new Hamburglar? <laughs> that is the hurry. <laughs> <We're> tra- <laughs> yes. We're trying to encourage a, a younger, uh, more male audience. <laughs> But what's up, guys? It's good to see you. It's episode not 28. Oh, my God. And yeah. Lyle had called me on it, and yeah. I uh, got distracted by some other things. So uh, uh, It's episode 3-0. Let's, uh, let's change that to episode 3 zero. And okay. we're back. There you go. <laughs> Something ah, would be too crazy. <laughs> <There you go. laughs> well, it's awesome. We've seen some new faces in chat. What's up, guys? We've got a lot of hits from you guys on YouTube. Um, a lot of cool comments. It's cool to see you guys chatting it up in there. Eric the Great. Um, yeah, Eric, thanks for hey, stopping by, man. man. Yeah, man, what's going on, man? Yeah, I'm, um, I'm so glad think, you're enjoying the show. Yeah, dude, thank you so much for watching the, the YouTube videos and finding us over at BoardGameGeek.com. We like to try to get the material up there and have some fun with it. I know we had a lot of fun with Dan Patrice last week, right, guys? Yeah, that was two awesome. Two weeks ago? Really two, cool Oh, guy, that was really two weeks cool ago. Guy. Oh, man. Yeah. I, I was in yeah, Vegas and, last uh, week. So it, you should be, it's his turn, right? In Las Vegas? It is his turn. Yeah, I've been waiting so, and waiting for him to take his turn. Yeah. So here's here's at you, dice, Dan. Dan. <laughs> <laughs> He's scared that we're like, I think we're beating him pretty good in there. Although Lyle and Angelo tied la- that one time, so we're going to definitely have to have yeah. him back on and have a re a rematch, ready on that. But uh, yeah, that was a lot of fun last week um, or two weeks ago. God, the yeah, last show that ago. we were on. Well, you were in Vegas last week, so it was probably yeah. all just a big blur. <laughs> Dude, it was. I mean, we we did a Don't Starve Together stream, our first one that Thursday afterward. Which yeah. was a lot of fun. Um, learning how to play Don't Starve and dying very quickly, starving immediately. <laughs> um, yeah, I, I I didn't watch the whole thing. I just I skipped around, right? And um, it was hilarious. It's 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 typical typical playing with Ange. <laughs> yeah, he just disappeared. Oh, yeah, yeah. You, you set a plan. You set a plan. You talk through the plan. He just disappears into the darkness. <laughs> leaving you alone yeah i was like i was like dude uh, if i was playing with you guys i would have been so mad i'd be like hey you're doing this again i told him <laughs> <laughs> that's what he did i, I <laughs> if you guys want to watch that we have it up on their youtube thing of us playing don't starve and i think we're gonna try that more often oh. but yeah basically angela left me to die he went to go get food did not get food i, I got lost in my own shadiness <laughs> <laughs> exactly life lesson. He got really shady so fast truth. <laughs> yeah we got a big the nothing sh- man the nothing swallowed <laughs> in that game <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah it was it was brutal but that game's fun we're definitely gonna try to do that more often uh play some more games like that um but i was in vegas last week i had a lot of fun got to see my sister which was a lot really cool played a lot of games played the ghostbuster slot machines like these 3d slot machines and they have these seats these gaming seats with like speakers on the side oh, that wow. totally like engross right. you in this 3d experience I, you guys gotta go check that i was pretty awesome so uh, what what else what else did you yeah. play down there? Um, you know, I was down there for work, so we didn't have a ton of time. I didn't go as crazy as uh, you know we've used to go in Vegas, but like yeah. the pools were awesome. I basically stayed <laughs> even the whole time. I played craps, put everything on twos, proved that that does not win you money. I do not roll twos in Vegas. I thought I had the system beat. I was like, I know I've rolled enough dice lately that I'm gonna totally kill it on twos. No, not at all. I don't think I rolled one hard four. Um, everything has the fire bet now if you're craps players, so that's really cool. Like, everyone plays the fire bet. Um, what else? But no, I basically just stayed even on blackjack, and uh, I played pool blackjack for the first time, so that was really cool. It's pretty good, man. Nice. Yeah, yeah. I love pool blackjack. You guys definitely got to play pool blackjack. Oh I mean, my God. that sounds... Yeah, that's... It that was unbelievable. <laughs> and I, I, I creeped everyone else at the table because the, the pool was warmed. And, like, I always thought, like, the pool blackjack, that the water just gets warmer because no one goes to the bathroom. <laughs> So I said that to the guy next to me. He goes, wow, they even warm these pools. I go, hey, you know why it's warm, right? <laughs> and then I realized what I was saying. <laughs> He's like. You always, you always have to make it weird, man. You always, I know. He you was like, have look, to like, make it weird, especially yeah, with strangers. Yeah, everything was cool at the table. And then now everyone thought I was peeing in the pool. I was like, yeah. dude, I, but I'm not peeing in the pool. Hey. I, I, <laughs> what were you guys up to, though? We'll get, we got a long mission ahead yeah, of us here. Yeah, I mean, there's, there's a lot to catch up on, right? Okay, so, we got so much yeah. to talk about. But uh, I, I want to definitely. What, what uh, happened? 
Right, let's let's go back. Let's go back a, a couple weeks here. Yeah, so, let's, let's roll the um, me me and Chris hung out uh, IRL, man. Yeah, IRL, dude. Oh, well, yeah, IRL. Uh, I hung out with uh, me and my wife went up there. We hung out and we played we played some games with your neighbors. We did. Uh, I played Super Fight mm-hmm. against your neighbor Nick. Yep. Yeah. Um, I think you won. And, what? I think you won yeah, the fight. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I won with Michael J. Fox <laughs> yeah, Michael. as Teen Wolf uh, with, uh, with a bunch of uh, trampolines. Trampolines and machine gun or something like that? <laughs> yeah, what and a Gatling gun. Um, Super fight. Super what else? Fight. What else? And then we played uh, Cards Against Humanity, which uh, Nick's wife, Eva, was destroying us. Yeah. And that was that was crazy. Uh, yeah, yeah, that was good. Oh, and, that, and then I played, what was, that, what was that crazy game that you made both me and Casey play before we left? Uh, oh lovely planet (laughs) the game from indie box (laughs) i even have a beach ball from it the most like yeah indie game from uh yeah i was was talking to them over at indie box um yeah they're very interested little company five people um i hit them up recently and told them we've talked about them and yeah i told them you tried that game so it's interesting right (laughs) it was actually pretty fun uh it was like it was so basic and i kind of liked it yeah, it's fun. I love those little indie games. And if you guys are like uh, indie games and want to get get something monthly like Loot Crate style, um, definitely check out IndieBox.com. That's a small company, I guess. They're up and coming, but uh, cool people. They're interested in their own company. That's what's going on. What else has been going on though? Let's we got to get into. Let's get... Um, I guess uh, the other big news is we got uh, we we have tickets. Oh, uh, Comic Con. We're going to Comic Con. Yeah, it only took me uh, uh, two and a half hours on the digital queue. Oh, man. Um, and by the time I actually got in there, uh, all the VIP tickets were sold out. Not surprised. Uh, I think like, and then um, I think Saturday was sold out too. Yeah, and the multi-day tickets. Like I heard it yeah, was. Yeah, the multi-day tickets were sold out. They put up a out. statement on their webpage that basically said in less than two hours, because they got slammed, the servers got crushed, mm-hmm. that everything sold out besides uh, Tuesday in record time they said the, the overwhelming they they don't even have tickets left like they didn't know what to do and well, they're actually was, for the yeah, for the first for the first 10 minutes um i was refreshing um two different browsers um so i was refreshing yeah. two different browsers and um it was just erroring out right so like yeah and then after 10 oh. minutes i finally got put in this like digital queue and then every like half an hour or so it would just time out and then I would have to refresh. I'm like, no, nah, yeah. do I have to start oh. over? Uh, yeah, I was like freaking out a little bit. Plus, I was in the middle of work and I had all these deadlines to right, do. Right. And, like, I kept refreshing like, the browser. And I was like, just, God damn it, Chris. <laughs> well, it's supposedly the biggest Comic-Con now. This is New York Comic-Con, guys. So if you guys are going to be at New York Comic-Con, we're going to be there on Tuesday. We decided to get, or not Tuesday, Thursday. Thursday. Sorry. Thursday. Thursday tickets. I said oh. Tuesday earlier. But we'll be there Thursday hanging out. Um we're going to have maybe some crit camp shirts and that kind of thing. So we're really excited to be at New York comic con. We're going to be talking to some, if you're a game designer and you're showing your game, we hope to talk to you guys. And if you're just a fan of the show or like comics and you see us there, say what's up, have a beer with us. They serve beer there. So well, I'll be drinking a beer while I walk around the floor, looking at Naruto stuff. We'll be meeting Hisashi. Oh, there you go. I don't want to bring out the book. Bah, Kishimoto (laughs) is going to be there, which we're really excited to go see that panel. (laughs) But I'm bummed to say what? You're not going to make it, huh, Ange? Not going to make no, it? No, not this uh, year. That sucks, man. This is my first. This is my first yeah, Comic-Con. This yeah, so come, first con. Uh, yeah, come, come, come say what's up to Lyle at his first con. It's going to be a lot yeah. of fun, guys. Oh, and what's up, man? What's up, nerds? What's up, Captain Napalm? Oh, Thank yeah, you so Captain much Napalm. for watching the backlog as well, guys. You get, we appreciate all the support of you guys. Oh, by the way, we, speaking uh, of Mijay's YouTube. in there, too. Hey, Mijay. Oh, Mijay's there. The QC team is building up. Psyched, guys, because we got a, a crazy one coming up. But, um... 100 views on YouTube, guys. Or not 100 views. Oh, <laughs> we, got 100, we got 100 subscribers. We got 100 subscribers. So thank you so much Pretty for the support, deal. guys. That's really cool. Um, it was psyched to see that when we got back from uh, Vegas last week. That Awesome, guys. Thank you so much. Really appreciate you guys subscribing and watching all the videos. You guys especially who walked our entire backlog. You got to see the arc of, like, crashing, crashing, <laughs> crashing, crashing. Yeah. Now less so. So I really appreciate you guys digging that, man. I'm, I'm, I'm psyched. We love the feedback. We love the rule corrections. Um, and we'll definitely get into that. What, what, Angela, you want anything you want to talk about you've been doing the last week? What's going on? Uh, well, I mean, my family and I and my friends went to a uh, Hershey place. No, 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 Sesame place. Sesame place. Yeah, man. Uh, Hershey was like two weeks ago. Yeah. That was fun, right? Yeah. Hershey and Sesame was great. I mean, it was really hot though. I was like, ah, oh, but... <laughs> 
<laughs> and they didn't have like the like the good pool stuff open, so we were just like sweltering in the heat. But it was a lot of fun. Gotten got into like a few rides. Yeah. Played a huge crane game. Didn't win anything big. Oh. Even though it dropped like twenty bucks. The crane. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. We did, give this crane. Yeah, the crane. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome, man. Yeah, I definitely yeah. want to take my little guy over there. Gamer dads. Yeah. Unite. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. Little kid would enjoy it, you know. He likes to run around. He he knows Elmo. They're they all yeah. go crazy. It's like ah oh, Elmo. Yeah, dude. That's crazy. Like I'm pretty sure my son photobombed like no less than twenty pictures. Trying to like nice. say hi to like Elmo. It's like, ah, it's like, no, oh, come back here. I'm sure Sorry. every photo a family takes there is just like little kids mobbing these, <laughs> like just blurs <laughs> of like little children everywhere. <laughs> he's just, he's just an excited little guy. So, yeah, exactly, yeah. man. That's awesome, dude. That's awesome. Well, what, what else? What else? Uh, oh, by the way, guys, we are totally interacting with you at, I think at a faster pace. We are trying now the reduced stream that Twitch is, uh, the reduced stream delay, I should say, that Twitch is uh, now opened up for. So thanks so much, Twitch, for trying to do that, not just for us, but for everyone out there. Um, for our stream, it's great. So now when we start doing something stupid, you guys can totally tell us we're doing something wrong or give us some recommendations in terms of strat, like ASAP. Yeah. At least everyone in chat who's here live, obviously. YouTube, just correct us as per normal. <laughs> we yeah. mess up and we'll have to justify it next week. <laughs> but uh, no, we've got a reduced stream delay. So awesome, guys. Definitely jump in on the conversation. And if you haven't joined us, come join us. It's a lot of fun. Uh, Mondo Cook's now in chat. Man, we got we got a fun chat going tonight. So what's up, everyone? Uh, especially everyone who's hanging out with us for the first time. We hope you come back every Tuesday. Um, but just so you know, if, you have a, if you're getting a little buffering, it supposedly affects poor connections. So if, we've, if you've got not the greatest connection, sorry about that. But um, everything does go up on our YouTube page. Um, and like we said, we had 100, views, 100 subscribers there. Ah! <laughs> um, what else do we want to get in? It's been a little bit. We got a New York Comic Con stuff. Um, so join us there in October. Uh, and also, like, no Scott Powered this week. This should be the Scott Powered Tuesday. Yeah. But sorry to say, Scott won't be here this week. He'll be with us next Tuesday. And sorry to say bah, bah, that it might be his last Tuesday with us for a while. His work schedule's changing up, and he's going to have to be at work super early on Wednesday morning since we do this on a school night. So uh, we hope to maybe start doing some streams on Monday. We, we've teased a Pathfinder um, stream with him and I have been talking about doing on Monday afternoons. So maybe it'll make it a reality. Or maybe we'll do something on Monday afternoons for you guys, which would be a lot of fun get Scott back in here. Uh, so... Be sure you join us next week and hang out with Scott and say what's up before uh, he takes a little bit of a hiatus. You guys been playing any Hearthstone, though? Let's get a little Hearthstone talk in here for a couple minutes. Um, No, actually. I still haven't, I, I still haven't even uh, finished the last wing of, of Blackrock, uh, so I don't even have all the cards yet. Oh, whoa. Yeah. Okay, not even on yeah, normal. It's been, a, it's been a few weeks. I just haven't. I've just been so busy um, with work and stuff that I haven't, I haven't gotten in there. And... Um, yeah, and I, I've been like rewatching episodes Game of Thrones because uh, Casey now finished season four uh, this weekend, uh, so she's now on season five. That's another and, show and, you need to get get on, Chris. I know, yeah, man. You need to get on this, and 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 everybody. I gotta say, I mean, I love what I love being current right now, mostly because I love listening to the Game of Thrones recap podcast that Peter Sagal has. If you don't know Peter Sagal is the host of Wait Wait Don't Tell Me NPR nerd right here. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> but 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 th these podcasts come out on Monday. They're hilarious. They're yeah, definitely want to check that out. You said uh, that was pretty awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, see, I don't watch Game of Thrones though. <laughs> like, but now they're changing it up. So I want to see like, I guess I should just watch this season because I, I hear this is the one that they. Well, you haven't watched it all. I, I watched clips of certain shows like i watched which one was the oh, so i know what like that means season i know what that means angela angela's uh googling for the for the nudie scenes yeah yeah exactly <laughs> yeah 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 whenever uh yeah you are whenever daenerys you're googling <laughs> boobs and blood that's what you're doing <laughs> that doesn't sound right that's disgusting no, no, no it doesn't <laughs> That didn't, yeah. Scratch that. Scratch that. Uh, we'll be cutting that out of the. Uh, if you caught yeah, it live, yeah, if you caught we, it live. Uh, if we it's actually did editing, we would cut yeah, that out. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, I, I was going to catch up on Daredevil and everything too. Yeah, catch up on that, man. Let's talk about it. Yeah, well, I was gonna, I was gonna catch up on that, but go go in flight Wi Fi. I was gonna do tons, five hours, five hours, um, but it didn't work out. So <laughs> the in flight Wi Fi was not going so well. Um, what else? Um, yeah, Hearthstone, whatever. Getting up there. 
you yeah. know, what this hybrid hunters taking over. So there's a little thing. Also, I saw today based on the hard stats newsletter. Did you see this, Angelo? Um, I know you're on there, but like if you play the hunter trap, if you play the what is it, the vaporize trap, not vaporize. That's mage. Mage. Uh, it was um, no, I think it's the snipe or something. I saw something in the hard stats thing. It's like if you play that trap before you play the freezing trap. It'll bounce the guy back to their hand. It'll activate the like. Yeah, weird. Now that I read that. Oh now, yeah, it, no, it was vaporized and freezing. Like yeah. when you attack the mage. Right. Oh wait, wait, no. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, it's like wait, in some wait. turn order, it bounces back to the hand. If they play that card again, it will actually vaporize it. <laughs> so I don't know if that's a a, a, a glitch. Oh no, but... no, no. It's it's uh, if the mage Kazan Mystics, a freezing trap, with vaporized feels... activated. So, yeah, like if it's a, it only works if the if between mage and hunter matchups, right? Obviously, yeah. So, like, yeah, if um, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Mage, how does wait? What what's the setup? So, all right. So, a, a mage has to Kazan. I think Kazan Mystic, a freezing trap, then play vaporize. So when they attack, the freezing trap activates first, and it gets bounced back. Yeah. But also vaporize. Oh wait, no, is it the other way around? Yeah, I think it might be vaporize. Anyways, yeah, it gets bounced back to your hand, but when you play it, it gets destroyed because yeah, it triggered vaporize. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah, crazy little things people are figuring out. <laughs> but you don't really see vaporize a lot. Yeah, not so much, but funsies for sure. All right, let's get into this game, guys. It's it's episode thirty. We're playing <laughs> mission five, easy mission. That's because we took a week off. So, no, it's literally called an easy mission, and we're, I believe, halfway through season two's booklet. What? Eddie? This will mark halfway through. Yeah, as soon as we hit mission ten, we're gonna jump to the uh, Toxic City Mall expansion missions, and we're gonna do the included missions for that, and then we're gonna go to season three. So we hope you guys yeah. are psyched. But um, here we go. I, I, but first, before we jump into it, I did want to mention that uh, I know I've got my notes here because of like resource management here, right? <laughs> um, we did get a rule <laughs> clarification from Ca Captain Napalm. Um, which is Jeff over there on YouTube leaving us some awesome comments um, in regards to the riot shield that we were using uh, battling toxic zombies. Did you see this, Lyle? I think you may have seen this in the notes. Yeah, I saw um, it in the notes. So basically we were playing... Uh, what the riot shield does is it gives you tough. Uh, and then if you remove it, you can then you can take a second hit, I believe, and get rid of the riot shield, right? I believe that. Yeah. That's what we've been doing. That's, how, that's what we've been saying. Right, right. Yeah. But technically... The rule described in the booklet and the mm -hmm. official rules state, tough, the survivor ignores the first attack he receives from a single zombie every zombie's phase. Yeah. So we can't use tough when taking a toxic blood spray hit. So if you attack, a, if you melee so, a toxic zombie... So we're zombie, saying that well, like, um, the toxic blood spray doesn't count as a zombie hit. No, it counts as a I, separate I, thing. A zombie phase my, hit. No, my take on it is that... It, <laughs> A toxic blood spray is defined as a wound, so I think it only applies to the second part of the riot shield's ability. So when you take a toxic blood spray, you have to discard it. Right. You can't use the first. You can't use it. Yeah, as you, oh, I see. I see. Okay. Yeah, we've been playing. I think we played that wrong when we were mail. We would use the riot shield and kill zombies in our same zone. You can do but, it. You could do it, but it would remove, remove the riot shield. It. It so, what, so are you saying that you don't you don't get tough? If uh... because it's a because the way the riot shield is defined, it says no, gives the gives the character the ability tough, and so when you look into what the ability tough is defined, it says it can only take a wound during a zombie phase. Right. If equipped, one gain the tough skill. Yeah, Two okay. discard to prevent one wound inflicted to the wearer. So, and then the, the description of the tough skill is you can only, uh, it, it only protects you during the zombies phase, an attack right. during the zombie phase. Right. Well, that's yeah, that's the, the, well, that's the only time they ever... Right, and Captain attack. Apalm stating that in chat, too. Tough only yeah. applies during the zombie turn. So we can't take some sort of toxic blood spray and take it that way. So we've been playing that possibly a little funky. We appreciate Captain uh, catching well, that. Thank you so much, man. Uh, that's but are we saying, are we saying, like, on our, on our turn, on, our, on the player's turn, when you uh, hack a toxic zombie in your zone, can you then discard the riot shield? Mm -hmm. to yeah. Prevent the, yeah. Okay. So we're still playing. So we can still discard it to 
to do the blood spray. Take the blood spray. Attack. Yeah, but the tough yes. part of it only happens right because that's just the right. Action. Like I think before it basically allowed us to take an extra hit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like yeah. we were tough, and then we weren't then discarding the shield. Yeah. We were able to keep the shield. We should technically, if we want to do yeah. that, use the shield. We have to lose the shield. Yeah. Gotcha. So you can't okay. hold on to the shield, guys. So sorry about that. Thank, thank you so much, Captain, for finding that. That's exactly what we need to... Uh, he also brought up uh, Mission 3, uh, the concrete saw. We were talking about this, and I left a comment with him in there that I think it might be a house rule. There is a tile, which is technically tile 5P, uh, the zone with a rotating gate. So if you guys... I don't know if you remember. If you come up through the middle, there was a, we opened a green door that opened into a ro rotating gate with walls that were kind of L'd, um, and it, it spawned the right side. We didn't spawn the other side because the rotating gate had a closed off edge. Oh, yeah. okay. And we didn't spawn it until we rotated the gate and that opened up that side for us. Um, oh, um, okay. Yeah, I, I kind of remember this. Yeah, we were basically like, discussing they, that when you open that door that both sides should have spawned even though one's blocked by the security gate before it had even rotated. I mean, my argument was that, uh, you know, and we don't have to stick on this too long. We can all discuss it later on. But the uh, I was saying that the gate actually doesn't... You can't see through the walls of the gate, nor can you pass through them. Therefore, it kind of acts as a wall until you rotate the gate. Mm. I mean, if you guys want to look back at that and then take a look later on, we can definitely talk about that. But yeah, he brought that up as a possible thing. So if you guys have any thoughts about that, leave it in this video or on uh, Mission 3 where we played Concrete Saw, uh, where we do that. We kind of just played it strictly that the gate blocks the view. You can't see through it. Therefore, the rooms are still cornered off. Yeah. They didn't spawn. Um, there's no strict rule in the rule book about that, I believe. Um, so we're, we're kind of discussing it. And so once again, thank you to Captain Napalm for bringing up that discussion. Rules. That's what we do. He's the rule lawyer. He called himself too. So, <laughs> welcome to welcome to awesome. the stream, awesome. man. Yeah. So let's get into some zombicide, guys. What do you say? Oh wait, wait. wait. Uh, we got um, EJ is saying in the chat. So that means characters that have tough also. Uh, yeah. So so characters that have tough. Um, Did he get double? Oh blood? right, right. No, he's saying yeah, that like, you can't take blo toxic blood spray. You can't and not take, take a wound. toxic blood spray. Yeah, you'd, right. you'd you'd be taking a wound. Like oh. so, if we're playing with Nick, who who initially has tough. And he's fighting a toxic guy in his own. Oh, so we uh, have we been playing tough wrong too. Well, we've like, been making tough maybe a little. We've been too we've OP. been assuming that the toxic blood spray is kind of like getting punched. You know, what I mean, getting getting hit by a zombie. But yeah, yeah. <laughs> Great. <Okay>. It <laughs> just makes it, a little, it makes it harder. <laughs> we made it a little bit op. I don't know how many times exactly we uh, I utilized think we kind it. Of abused it. We well, might the have thing is, like, times, we haven't but... really been playing with tough people. Actually. Yeah, we have with with that. With the last time we were Scott Powered, right? It was like Nick right. and uh, yeah, and falling down on that one side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But uh, <laughs> uh crap. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, we appreciate you guys catching it, and this is all all learning for us. So we played it. It's good. Once again, it's part of the it's part of the project. It's part of the experiment. We're opening it up to you guys. We're opening it up to the forum. So this is a great way for people to learn and play the game right. As uh, Dan Patrice was telling us too, the board game man. This game has a lot of rules, and these kind of games take a lot of uh, QC team members like my J, Captain Napalm, and everyone else out there that helps us with these uh, these rules, both live and uh, on YouTube. So let's yeah, get into it's, it, guys. It's, it's definitely it's definitely helpful. Um, yeah, appreciate because, it, guys. Thank you yeah, so much. We, we would we obviously didn't catch these things. So yeah, it's awesome. So we hope we'll, it's still entertaining, I hope, <laughs> and educational. That is our point. That is our goal. And we hope you guys have a fun game night with us. <laughs> yeah. We're all learning together, man. And, and Napalm says, too, I don't think you've used Tough with Toxics, except okay. for the Riot right. Shield. There you go. All he right would then. know. Cool. He just finished watching, so thank you so much. <laughs> yeah. Don't leave us any comments, people. You just justified it. <laughs> uh, oh, and uh, before, before we move on, uh, let's just do the, a quick uh, whatcha drinking. So... Yeah. Wow. Um, I have the Shiner Ruby Redbird. Uh, the it's been weeks like and you're still weeks and weeks and weeks, dude. It's it's like it's like spring summer, man. It just it just feels right. It just feels right. <laughs> what about you, Chris? Oh, I'm drinking the light. I, 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 why? You want to see what I'm drinking this time? See if we're drinking the same thing again? No, Occulto? Occulto? <laughs> Occulto? No, I am not <laughs> drinking right. that ever again. This is Lining Kugels, the summer shandy. My wife picked it up, and it's summer, like you said. So yeah, it's, it's a summer. good one. It's a good uh, what, Wisconsin beer. Yeah little lemon a little yeah. little there yeah it's hot yeah. as hell up here so <laughs> i'm i am sweating so this will hopefully cool it off what are you drinking Ange? 
<laughs> Uncle Doug, yes. Aww. Yes. It's not yes. bad. I, you know, I, uh, I had one of those. At, I gave at, one uh, a while. I was like, yeah, yeah, this. I had one of those. I was like, <laughs> what mm. did you well, you know what? It was it 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 was better than what I remember. Tequila. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> but it still wasn't so great. Yeah, yeah. and now we understand. Even the that, uh, over the, the next few weeks, because yeah, Tuesday nights are the only night I drink, <laughs> <laughs> which makes sense. <laughs> um, but awesome, guys. What are, what are you drinking out there? Chat. Let us know. Let's talk some beer. If you guys have some site favorites, um, if you're not drinking beer, if you're drinking some tea, tell us about your tea. If you're talking yeah. about your water, you know, let's talk water. It doesn't matter. You, know? you don't have to drink booze. You can have a good time. It's game night. Everybody's invited. So let's get into this, guys. Let's go into the mission page. We're playing mission five. It's an easy mission. Hopefully it stays an easy mission. Enhance. 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 Uh, well, enhance? enhance. Enhance, I say. Oh, that's not enhance. That is scoot, the, scoot over. <laughs> <laughs> all right pan pan so it's an hands. easy mission we just want to clean this medium security quarter there are lots of cells full of zombies we just open the cells and then kill all the zombies what could go wrong our main concern is the dining hall it is closed with one of these security doors that does nothing can open what <laughs> our main concern is the dining hall it is closed with one of these security doors that nothing can open except the right switch and we couldn't find it we'll probably have to cut it with a welder uh, that we found in the last mission <laughs> meanwhile this little cleaning mission will give us time to make a decision about it. I'll leave this decision oh. to you. <laughs> <laughs> so there you guys, there's the board. Wow, do you want to talk about it a little bit? Yep. Okay, so basically we start uh, up at the top uh, with the, at the player starting area, that blue thing, right next to the purple thing and right next to the exit. And basically what we have to do is we have to make it all the way around. Uh, this, these are considered sort of indoor alleys, uh, and they're treated like streets right next to these cells. We have to make it all the way down and around and back up, and we have to pick up the oh, – activate the purple switch and the white switch. Now what happens is – when you activate each of these uh, switches, the, the player that activates the switch gets that X of the same color, gets 5 XP, and all of the doors of that color open up, which means that zombies spawn and then uh, they start coming out. And so basically we just have to open both switches and then make our way back to the exit. Now we don't have to make the way back to the exit with everyone, so people could die. So this is actually would have been a really great mission with Scott. Uh, if he was here, because that's yeah, his right? favorite. He'd kill us uh, all off, yeah. or leave me. <laughs> He'd just kill me and <laughs> help you guys survive. <laughs> um, but yeah, so basically that's that's all we have to do. We have to go around, we have to activate both switches, and we have to make it back to the exit. And um, when we exit, there can't be any zombies in that zone. Um, you can see three zombie spawns, uh, two on the left, one on the bottom. And when we pick up and we activate the um, the purple switch, the purple spawn activates there. Um, another thing that is uh, that's happening in this mission is the striped area, the hatched area uh, in the middle. Um, that's going to have um, a gun blade and a riot shield inside, uh, and it takes one action to pick that up. To so uh, forever uh, uh, for whoever gets in there and wants to take those. Um, you also see two red X's at the top left. Um, those are just purely XP. You can pick them up and get five XP. But that's also your motorcycle crashed in the lower right corner, I think. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, that kind of, yeah, is, is, is that your motorcycle like there? No, I was like, it, look, it, it looks like it looks enhance, like motorcycle. Enhance. Enhance. There yeah, we go. it looks like Jane, too. Yeah. <laughs> look at that. Look at that yeah, motorcycle. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's the right color. Sorry, man. So this is, uh, this is a real mission, guys. This is real close to Lyle's heart right here. Yeah. It just Have got you ridden real. Jane lately? What? <laughs> no, she's, she's still, uh, she's still uh, winterized. Because uh, I haven't been back to my dad's, uh, so like it's just hanging out in my dad's garage. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. Well, the thing is, like, I wanted to close on my house, <laughs> and then bring the motorcycle to my house. But since oh. that's taking forever, it's just sort of sitting in my dad's garage. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> well, here we go, guys. There's the board. There's Lyle's motorcycle over there, just so you can see it. Got our guy starting at the top of the corner there. I don't know why the right side of the board isn't in focus, but the left is. That's funky. That's cool. That's new. That's hip. It's with it. It's a cool effect. <laughs> we'll go with it. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, as Lyle described, we're going to be playing on this board here. We're starting at the top there. Psych to go. Got the weapons there in the middle. I just put the cards there so we know where they are. Um, that's why those are laying in the middle of the board. Um, let's jump to our character choice. 
Let's keep this train on moving. Keep this train on moving. <laughs> and thank you so much to Shaq News. Thanks, guys, over there for uh, hosting us again. Really appreciate it. What's up, Shaq? Um, now, here's our character selection screen. I still haven't decided. I'm stuck between two characters, and maybe Chat can throw out some recommendations for who I should go with second. But I'm actually going to be starting with Smithy. Smithy. Yeah, going back to Snake Plissken here, man. I think uh, having him, the free combat action, I think we're going to do a lot of fighting on our way yep. out. You know, we're going to go and get those X's, but it's going to be a constant battle. So one more combat action is going to be super valuable, I feel like. Um, and later on, he gets lucky. So I'm down with that. Vegas style. Yep. So what do you guys think? I mean, I told you guys earlier, I'm thinking I'm stuck behind, between Kirk and Mike. If anyone else wants to throw out a recommendation um, from these few seasons, we don't play the season three or their promo survivors yet, but I'm thinking it's either Kirk or Mike. I mean, both of them, both of them are good. I mean, Kirk, Kirk can handle the abominations. Yeah, Kirk and he is the bomb killer. Yeah. And then Mike, because well, we the start, chainsaw. yeah, and we start right off. We're getting right into the fight with those rooms. Uh, I almost think that the chainsaw might be what we want to do here, but. Ange? Hmm. Hey, Johnny. Uh, abomination. <laughs> I know, I know. It's, we do, we do end up some? spawning a lot of abominations. Yeah. Any, uh, yeah, anybody in the chat have a, have a preference here? Yeah, what do you guys or, think? I'm going to, I'm going to go with the old sensei. Oh, uh, okay. All right. We have no one else yeah. that has Slippery, right, that we're going to be choosing? I don't no, think so. Yeah. Well, the thing is, like, Slippery isn't really that important either because we need to clear the exit, right? So we yeah. can't just have him slip out. Yeah. So. I mean, he can at least get there if the zombies walk away from it or something, but you know what I mean? Uh, Crumb oh, says Crumb. Mike. Crumb says Mike. That's one. Yeah, should we do a straw poll? <laughs> yeah, straw I don't know if we have time to sit here. We've already 30, 30 <laughs> minutes into the stream. <laughs> we're going to do a straw poll. All right. Are we thinking Mike? Lyle's for Mike. Crumb shoots Mike. I think Ange is like in uh, Obama's biggest. No, oh, I think Mijay. I think Mijay has gone Kirk. Yeah. So we're split. All right, who's going to be the third vote? First okay. one in. Come on, first one in. We're doing it. I'm about to switch. I'm about to switch mine. No, yeah, we. I think we got two for two here. I think we're two and two. Who's going to be the third one? Mm. Kirk or Mike? Kirk or Mike? Watch, someone's going to say like. Want? I knew yeah, someone was going to say this. <laughs> what is this? No. God. Option C. No, I knew. I was like, the, the answer someone's going to give is someone completely not an option. No. Okay. <laughs> go, go, uh, you know what? Go, go with the old sensei. Go with the old sensei. Going with the sensei? Yeah. Oh, Kirk. Oh, Kirk. There you go. Okay. Yeah, there, there you go. go. And my Jay's, my Jay's thinking of it strategically. Yeah. Okay. So then we're going Raul, Lyle. Yeah, I'm going with Raul. Uh, I like Raul because he's got the webbing, uh, which means that every anything in his inventory is equipped, which is good against Berserkers and Toxic uh, as soon as I get equipped. But um, I like the Medic ability, too. Um, so that's why I'm picking him. He's been, he's been pretty solid. Okay. Okay, and then your second, Troy. Troy, yeah. I'm switching things up a little bit. Uh, we, we never picked Troy. I think we mm. picked him like maybe once in like Season 1. Can't even remember. But he starts with a sawed off, which I think is important yeah. to get another weapon uh, already Kiss loaded me. up. Give me some sugar. Uh, and in RNG gets tough, uh, which is going to be awesome because uh, I think we're going to kill a lot of things really fast. Um, and then he gets webbing later, which I think is awesome too. And he's also so in in uh, some awesome horror, cult horror films. If you guys know who he is, shoot him off. If you know his name, give me some sugar. I believe is his best <laughs> quote. <laughs> give me some sugar. The Book of the Dead. No? You guys? No? You know who this guy is? No. Okay. I mean, no. you're going to get some disappointed pokes in the chat. I'm not going to give uh, it away. Bruce Campbell. <laughs> it is Bruce Campbell. Thank you. All right. <laughs> give me some sugar. All right. Who are you going for? Uh, Shannon. Oh. Nothing yeah. compares to you. <laughs> so, uh, where is she? Where is she? Right here. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, since this is going to be all like CQB, you know, we're going to need point blank so we're not all like, up in each other's grill shooting each other in the face. That's right. This is this is one of your go-tos. I think you just like to hear Lyle and I sing, nothing compares. <laughs> I'll go low. To you. Nothing, nothing. 
<laughs> that was good. I think we had something there. Yeah. We're getting better. <laughs> All right. Boom. And then Freddy. Oh. Oh. I haven't played Fred with Fred in a long time. The old throwback. Yeah, yeah. Super psyched. It's a throwback. I'm bringing him in. I'm bringing him in. So we have, that's right, Nears Beware, Shop Smart. <laughs> we've got we've got Army of Darkness going on. We've got Shaun of the Dead. We've got Escape from New York, L.A., whatever. Snake Plissken. Who else we got in this game? And then we got, I think we all got someone cool. And we got Machete. We got, what's his name? From Machete. All right. Machete. Kirk. One of these days, one of these days, we should we should really do the old, the old, the old throwback, the old, the old, the old favorites, right? Yeah, yeah, Solo, definitely. Yeah, Frank High Voltage. Yeah, uh, Fred. Yeah, just throw them all, all right. throw them all in there. Look at that! Look at that! Everyone's hyping up the Fred. <laughs> yeah, Fred. <laughs> Reapers OP. <laughs> Reaper. And by broken, you mean yeah. amazing. Yeah, exactly. We haven't even brought him out. This is an old. This is Angela's old standby. All right, man. That's the team, guys. Let's check it out. Cool. Let's get the equipment deck. Let's get the zombie deck. Let's go season two. Uh, yeah. What do we play? Um, Season one, hey, we do all the decks. We we do all, uh, do, you think know. we might be able to take a quick uh, break? Already? Yeah, 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 yeah. I just got to take care of something. Um, yeah, we might. Yeah. We can take a quick break here in a second. I just want to make sure we got our decks right. We got our decks yeah. right here, guys? Yeah, let's do the. Yeah, let's just two. see what we got for inventory, and then we'll take a. Season two. Season one, deck full. Toxic City Mall. No yeah. extra cards, right? Yep. I think this is right. I don't think I can. Yep. Season one, season two, Tuck City Mall. Let's start this game, boys. Boom. Let's start this game, boys. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Like... All right. And the iPad crashed. All right. Oh, nice. So S- Smith will be starting with a nightstick. Yep. Kirk, nightstick. Raul, claw hammer. All right. right. Troy, pistol. And you should get a shot off. Yep. Search. Search. Whoops. Crap! Oh, Dude, the cookie! Oh, oh, the cookie! Yeah, yeah. Okay, fine cards. Ranged. Uh, what looks like a sawed off. That. Oh, oh, oh! There you Boom. go. Thank you. Okay. Sawed off. Shannon, fire axe. Fred, dice stick. And I think we're set up right, right, guys? Yeah. Okay. All right. Never mind. We don't have to take a break. You don't want to take a break? No, no. All right, we're about to take a break in probably uh, just a little bit here, but I think we're good there, right? Yeah. Okay, guys, I think it's time to jump into the gameplay. Let's get this ready. Whoa. Are you ready for the best effect ever? Ah! Ah! Okay, it's game time. And as you can tell, the crit counter is up. Crits. We got no crits. Twos. It's a no twos. So pick it your is. team, guys. Yeah. Town. Throw that into the chat Crit there if you're going for zero. If you're going for crits of the twos, join your team. Choose wisely. So, what are we doing here, guys? What is our? Oh, and I'm going with Kirk. We chose the most bland character colors, and they kind of cut off at the top there. It's all right. Um, crap! So, I can't do anything. <laughs> I mean, you can grab the axe and open the door. I mean, should we should we open the door and just try to get equipped? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, there's that, or we can actually go. Isn't this one giant, like, space? It's one giant loop, but, I yeah. mean, do we have enough weapons to... No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we're just going to go into that middle center, and that's going to be our weapon up? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So let's do a trade. Who's got the fire axe? Claw hammer. Or we could trade for the claw hammer. I'll go for the fire axe, because you're going later, maybe? Okay. That way things can change around. Maybe I don't know. Here, have a nightstick. Boom. Smith. Open the door. It's right. two. Spawn it. <laughs> Boom. Still cracks me up that you guys used to roll for doors. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean that was that was that was called the extreme. That was called a hardcore mode yeah. we played. Yeah, yeah. Heroic. Ooh. That was heroic mode, dude. <laughs> Toxic runner. Oh no. Toxic runner right off the bat. One walker every manhole. There's no manhole, right? Right? Yeah, there's no manholes. Yeah, we're inside. Oh that's great. Yeah. Well we're like we're like inside outside. <laughs> oh, where are we spawning first? Bottom? 
bottom. Oh, I guess I started already, at the top. <laughs> you started at the top, so all right. <laughs> and then the bottom. Oh, yeah, wait. wait. Well, I wish oh, I that's right. Oh, you know what? Mm. Oh, my bad. I am out of my game. I thought we were doing our spawn. No, no, I just opened that door. Okay, yeah. so I've got two more actions here, and there's a toxic runner in there. Uh, You, you can, can trade and shoot. Yeah. You can trade for yeah. the, uh, oh, yeah. the sawed off and shoot. Good thing we had that guy start. <laughs> But then we're gonna have to reload this. Oh, I'll take the pistol. Yeah. Ooh. What should right. I do? Yeah, yeah, take the pistol. Yeah. I'll take Either the pistol or. and take the shot. Leave me with my lore. Or is it better that I try to really get this kill out of the way so that we can get in there? It's probably best that I get the kill. Right? Yeah, yeah. but you have so many people behind you. Yeah. I don't want to waste actions. Okay. Action management. Traded, goes yep. for the combat. Yeah. Hard four. Double three. Oh, oh, look at that. Four. Look at that. <laughs> you killed him twice. <laughs> Boom. All right. Good start. Good start. Went up one. Back. Smith pulls it off. Yeah, Smith. Yeah, man. Okay. Kirk's moving in. Kirk's going to search. Yep. Ferex. Oh, very nice. And then... Uh, now I can kill the bombs. That's right. And then he's just going to move up one, right? Is this how we yeah. want to do this? Like, do we want to yeah. go out that way? Yeah. Or, or yeah. Move we can just go out that way. Yeah. South, I mean? Yeah. Okay. Raul. Uh, he's going to go in. He's going to search. Goes in. Searches. Load him up. Katana's. Nice. Oh, katana? Oh, oh, katana. Uh, move down. All right. Yeah, Troy's going to go in. He's going to search. In. Search. Shotgun. Nice. Sweet. And then, and then move, move down. down again. Okay, this is Troy, by the way. I know it's not Troy's mini, but I don't have Troy's mini. So. Okay, that's all right. He's looking like a, a bee, a badass. All right. Repeat. All right, nothing compares to you. Yep. Goes in, searches, gets a rifle. Ooh, all right. Nice. Got That's, a rifle. Uh, the worst weapon for her with yeah. point blank. <laughs> <laughs> okay, staying as a team here. Staying as a team. Freddy. Repeat. In search. Yep. Pistol. Nice. Moved out. Also, I'm using a kill right, so zomb wait, zombivore for. What's the rule for, um, for rifles? Uh, you can shoot it uh, okay. one to three spaces away from you. But not indoors, right? Or uh, Indoors, you can only shoot to the next room. All right. So the alleys, did it count as outdoor spaces? The, uh, the alleys count as outdoor spaces. Yeah. So I can shoot through like three. this area? Like this area, you could shoot th three spaces in. That's yeah. pretty good. The All streets right. there. Yeah, you can kind of see how it loops around. Okay. You can shoot out there, yeah. Yeah. All right, so wh where do we want to start the spawns at, boys? Uh, start the spawn at the bottom. South. Nothing. Okay. One runner. OG runner. Toxic walker. All That's right. it. All right. Good round one, guys. Good round one. Did you, uh, uh, actually, move, the zombie? Did you move the zombie? There was a zombie. Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right, Kirk. Take care of business. Yeah. Uh, four plus, four plus. Do you want to overkill? No, night stick. I'm just going to beat him with a stick. Yeah. Boom. Just enough. All right. You'll pick up that riot right. shield. Yeah. Kirk's well on his way. Right. Do you want Kirk to pick it up? Someone. Uh, anyway. Like, know, you want, do, you get, you want... do we get XP from that? I don't think so, do we? No. No, you don't get XP for picking up the right. Just it takes stuff. an action, right? Yeah. yeah. So he's gonna pick it up? Um I mean you can leave it to Shannon to pick up. Or uh or Fred or something. I mean I'm all melee. Who doesn't... Yeah, I was like who who doesn't have a weapon? Well, that was one action, so um uh... <laughs> Everyone I mean, we're pretty... all pretty equipped. We could actually 
Yeah, I think the only guy. Yeah, I mean, whatever. Wow. I, mean, I would right. be nice to have a melee. I mean, a ranged for Kirk, I guess. <laughs> He's the only one yeah. without okay. like. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Right, 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 so take it. yeah. Cause I was gonna trade cool. the rifle for with Fred, cause Fred's okay with the rifle. Boom. I mean, Steven Seagal gets a riot yep. shield and a gun blade. Nice. Nice. Oh, they he puts both of them up. I thought it was just like pick one up. No, it is. No, he gets both of them. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, so that's a sweet sisters. It's a gun blade. Yeah. yeah blade. And what was it? Oh, right shield. So you're gonna obviously gonna equip that gun blade. I think it's badass. Where's the right shield? Do, 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 do. Oh, it's two damage. You don't even need the axe equipped. Oh, there is. You can just equip the gun blade and the riot shield. They, all right. So melee and the gun. Um, yeah. Deal two. For the gun blade, you get to choose whether you want to shoot it or or hack with it. Yeah. But so they the both blade, the blade gets two dice. The gun gets one die. Okay. What was it? Was it uh? Good job, guys. We it got was the like weapons. An old Wes Andersony thing. Gunblade. Where he had the. Isn't it a movie? Oh, the American like Express commercial. The, uh... Can I get a like a Magnum with a bayonet? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That was awesome. <laughs> that's what I that's what I think of when I say the gunblade. Gunblade. I wanna, I'm thinking it was like a movie or something. You guys know? Anyone in chat know if Gunblade was a movie? It sounds, sounds like, like it was. Oh, oh it though. sounds like a movie, Gunblade. Yeah. Oh, it sounds like an anime show. That also sounds like an anime, yeah. So uh what are you doing here, Lyle? Oh it's like gun grade. Um I'm going to search. Forgot to give myself the Kirk. You're going to search. Sawed off. Okay. Would you like to? Uh, uh, I'm going to. Who has the other one? Uh, me, Smith. Do you want dualies or? <laughs> Actually, no. I want to keep it. I want to keep it. You don't want to equip it. Uh, everything's always equipped. Oh. <laughs> what? Uh, what? Oh, this guy. Which, by uh, the way, uh, Mondo Cook was letting me know today that he has a connection with the guy who did Hacker's uh, music theme. Met him on Twitter. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I think yeah, if yeah, I'm right, yeah, he can correct yeah, me if I'm wrong. The guy who wrote the music for uh, Hacker's, he knows, or he, he hooked up with on Twitter. So I was like, dude, <laughs> we got to get him to do some music from... for Crit Camp. <laughs> The music from Hackers was like a bunch it was of all electronic. It was a bunch of them, I guess. Don't worry about it. Including, including the one of the best songs ever. Is like, Get yourself connected. Audience <laughs> on the wall. Okay. <laughs> Simon Boswell, IMDb that. Boom. Yeah. We'll all right, man. The Boz. What are you doing? You got two more actions, dude. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> I know uh, I brought up Hackers and like throw you yeah. off. <laughs> I guess it's, uh, do you want me to open this door? Yeah. Yeah, so you can move down and open the door. The southern door? Yeah. One, pops the door with a claw hammer. Yeah, so hot. So hot, nerds. Those beats. Yeah. <laughs> Those 90s beats, man. They're so hot right now. So hot right now, dude. <laughs> I would totally bust it out if I had the Spotify going here. <laughs> uh, search. Yep, stereo MCs. You're going to search? You want to start heading out? Yeah, I'm going to search. You don't want to head out? I'm, I'm saying I'm just giving you an alternate. I was like, I'm going to search and then head out? How about that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wasn't like every song in that soundtrack like either like connected it was like or connection? <laughs> you just got the gas mask. Yeah, what does that do, man? Survivor is immune to toxic immunity or toxic blood spray. Oh, nice. so there we go, wait, wait. guys. We don't I need, need we don't need our OP wrongly played tough. <laughs> we just we get, need to. Uh... We've never gotten the gas mask. That's one of the things I think yeah. we've never drawn. Yeah. Wait, do I need to have it equipped, or, or can I just have it hang out in the back pocket? Uh, no. Whatever, it just and it's survivor. hanging out on my it's face. Probably just like, like a goalie mask. Right? Yeah, it's like a goalie mask. So the the survivor is immune to toxic blood spray. Is all it says Great. on it. So it's it's on. So you, we man. don't even have to discard it. Like if we take a toxic blood spray. You're just immune. Yeah, you're immune to toxic blood spray. So dude, I'm, I'm, dude, I'm, I'm OP right now. You should give that to someone who has melee. You're the one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, actually, yeah, I should, I should give it. You're just to blasting. You should give it to anyway. Kirk or something like that. 
But yeah, probably think, eventually. We'll worry about it some other time. Yeah, we'll worry, we'll worry about, about that later. We'll worry about it later. When all these cells open up and we have to battle. All yeah. right, so I'll leave. Uh, yeah, leave. Heading south. Heading south. Can't go south and I do. Right What's that song? It's like a um, <laughs> connection. Is I always, I always sing that mm-hmm. song. Um, it's like so similar to the beginning of The Sopranos. <laughs> no, yeah, now it's all stuck last, in my head. That's it. You gonna? Uh, oh, uh, Shannon's turn. Yeah, Search? Shannon. Searching. Yeah. Search. Why not? Pistol. Pistol. A lot of ranged happening this game. I know. Of course, when it's like a major. All right. I guess I'm not... All right. Move out. Okay, move out twice. Are you good with your arrangement of stuff? Yeah, because you, you picked up the pistol. You could have rearranged your inventory. Oh, okay. You could. You can still do it. I'm just... Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, yeah. Did you want to? At yeah. that... What do you want to do? Put the nightstick away or... Um... No, switch it for the rifle. Like this? Interesting. You know what's great about that rifle and where you are? You can totally want it around this corner. Oh, yeah. It's, there is it, it two zone? Is it like, yeah, is that I don't know, can side? we? I kind of want to like... <laughs> no, you can't shoot diagonal. Why not? Yeah. It's two yeah. zones, It's technically man. like, you can... Well, we're not, we're not shooting... You have total line of sight, man. If I never told you bullets fly straight... <laughs> <laughs> All right, carry on before we get too deep. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Magaboy, Magaboy. Searching... Fred searches. Baseball bat. Yeah. Almost Lord. I think the closest to Lore we can get with him. Uh, you want to equip that bat? It's, it's better than a nightstick, right? Uh, nightstick just protects you from a wound. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it, it swings yeah. for higher. You can hit easier with it. So swapped. Okay. Yep. And then move out. Mm-hmm. Moving out. Okay. Smitty. Smitty. Smitty is also going to search because it's funsies. Everyone else is doing it. Jack and Jill. Whoa. Ultra Whoa. red. Too bad. Uh, we'll save that for later. Yeah. Then I'm just going to head out with you guys. And just uh, just a quick note on ultra red for anybody watching that uh, doesn't know. You can only use those weapons when you're in red. Uh, the red experience level. Uh, otherwise, you can just uh, discard it and gain uh, 5 XP. All right. Spawn some zombies. One walker. Oh, man. Eric, Eric believes in, the, in curbing the bullet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, we can't shoot the diagonal. Like, we can't shoot at that walker. We have to move one and then shoot down. That's kind of stupid. <laughs> I don't think we've ever had this situation before. I know. I don't think no, we've, we've ever never, seen we've a No, we've never had, like, like, a, like, a, like, a chamfered corner before. No, but the, the one that, the, that one's zombie that fought in the bottom. Like, we can't oh, shoot Oh, yeah, the, like, the, yeah, the diagonal. Oh, that one? Because you, you kind of think you're, like, in an open street. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> If I told you bullets fly straight, could you shoot across? <laughs> could you shoot diagonally in an open street? <laughs> uh, <whatever>. Um, yeah. <laughs> it's, All right. Where yes. am I? I'm in the street. No, you're in the building with uh, Steven Seagal. We're still. Uh, we're in the Gudblain right. room. Okay. Uh, jump out and shoot this thing. Shoot the. Could you open the door? Jumps out. Shoot the... Oh, you need to swap your inventory though. No, I don't. Oh no, you don't. Yeah. <laughs> And this is why Chris doesn't play Raul. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't <I> do that. <laughs> I love that it works. App by yeah. Twisted Key. That's a double crit. Oh man, really double good. crit for the first crit of the night. Super overkill on the runner. Kill those OG runners. Ah, there's your first crit, yo. Boof. All right, man. All right, move, move forward. It moves up. All right. Good kill, man. Good kill. What's weird is, yeah, that 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 now that walker down there is really tripping me out. 
Yeah. <laughs> that we can't shoot it at a di- like we actually have to move out of the get way. The, to... Get the crit counter up, man. Oh, that's right, the crit counter. I forgot. I'm still getting used to the, the crit counter here. Crits, one. All right. Nice. Uh, with Troy, I'm gonna go uh, one, two, and shoot the Walker. <laughs> Saved it, right? Okay. Yep. Okay. Uh, with Troy, you're gonna what? One, two, and shoot with a shotgun. The walker. Okay. With the shotgun. Yeah. Oh yeah, satisfying. One, two, shoot. Fail. Oh, Troy. Come on. He's technically a sawed-off man. You put a whole shotgun in his hand. I know, he's just like, where's my lore? Yeah, he's like, uh, one-handed, tries to shoot this huge shotgun. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Nothing compares yeah. to you. What are you doing, Shannon? All right. Um... Get through this round, and we'll probably take our first break, guys. Yeah. No, those weren't twos, were they? I think they were threes. Was it a two? No, they were threes. I think they were two double threes again. My Jay, don't even try. <laughs> <laughs> or, or, or he's He might be calling out the two crits. Oh, uh, <laughs> what are you doing, right. Range? Um, yeah, move up, shoot. Uh, um, what, what? Yeah, we're. Um, oh, make up for his shortcomings. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> oh, oh, you mean make up for what he couldn't get done, right? Nice. How, how quickly we forget my my double crit. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, it's what have you done for us lately, man? Yeah, it's brutal. It's brutal. It's brutal out there. <laughs> Good kill. Fred. Fred's right there. At the bottom. Hello? Oh, oh you're good. I thought you froze. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah. Um, damn. Yeah. Um, what well, do we keep moving? I mean, what's are we gonna get the X, the purple X, like last? Is that the plan? Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, just uh, move up to where um, Shannon is. You don't want to go anymore. No, because there's the toxic zombie. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I see. Setting up. Yeah. Smitty. Prep fan. Do we care about this guy behind us that we can... Not really. No? Just keep moving? Yeah, not really. I mean, you can kill him. I mean, there's nothing... One free combat. I mean, combat. you have an extra... Yeah, you have an extra. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to back up. No, I'm going to go down. I'm like... Hey. <laughs> nice seeing you. And yes, he can't shoot that. I know, Daredevil. <laughs> Boom. You Great. did. Great. Oh, that's a cringe. Oh. Sir, from Snake Plissken. The crit saves a two. <laughs> Boom. Give me some more good Snake Plissken quotes, chat. What do you got out there? I know you guys know your escape from New York, escape from L.A. Uh, that's two, I think, right? Yep. Damn. Oh, and we got to put the crits at two as well. Crits, two. There it is. Nice. And then uh, let's come up with Raul. Let us know, guys, if you think our strategy of opening purple last is good. <laughs> think ahead for us. No. Um, hmm. Yeah. So, Kirk. I like what Eric the Great is saying. What's he saying? What's Eric recommending as our strat? Just to uh, have two um, people hang back to clear out the purple spawn. I was once we f- grab it. Yeah. Uh, well, also... Oh, sorry. Escape also, when we when we do the white switch, all the white doors what? open too. Uh, so, so yeah, we, we, we could we could leave somebody behind just to take care of the stuff that spawns in those cells. Yeah. Uh, there's also a, a fear that uh, they get sort of separated from the group and then just die on their own. <laughs> well, that's the thing. Not everyone yeah. has to survive. So, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, if if we can get enough of the group up there to just clear that spawn and get out. As long as we get one dude out and everyone else dies, we win, right? Yeah. 
<laughs> All right, and yeah, Mondo Cook says, fun fact, we just got a fun fact. Bruce Campbell is an escape from L.A., by the way. Ooh. So 15 degrees, if you guys know your movies, man. He knows, he knows his, Mon Mondo Cook knows his movies. Kirk, uh, so do, do we want to do that, guys? Do we want to kind of set this up in some way? So who, who would we let hang back? Uh, Kirk is pretty Kirk. well equipped. I mean, we've got a lot yeah. of dudes are pretty well equipped here. I mean, it's just a matter of yeah. getting up there, getting that X, and then just everyone coming down so we can get the next one and then battling our way out. Rather than letting them, like, hoard up. I think that's going to be yeah. the biggest issue if they get... So, like, down where Smith and Raul are is maybe almost a good spot to sort of set up camp as a pinch point, maybe? Yeah, yeah I mean, you can leave Kirk. Open. Uh, leaving Kirk. Uh, like these three guys, Raul, Kirk, and Smitty? I mean, yeah, that's fine. I mean, I, I think we're all pretty well equipped. We can split yeah. that way. Two of your guys? Well, like... <laughs> yeah, two of my guys and uh Yeah man. Yeah, we'll, we'll hang back here. Remember the last time <laughs> when I covered the, the West Wing? You remember I fought off all those zombies <laughs> that never spawned? <laughs> that was Scott and I. We held that dude, we held that alley down so well, man. It was great. <laughs> guys, man, I'm keeping it together here. Don't worry, guys. It's all good. Your turn. <laughs> so do we want to just keep these three dudes back here? Yeah, why not? Okay. But uh, the forward three people, they have something to open the door with, right? Who would that be? That would be yeah, Shannon. Uh, Shannon, who else? Uh, Fred. Fred. I don't have one. <laughs> Shannon, Fred, and Troy? Actually, Shannon, Fred, and Troy don't look like a very, <laughs> very good uh, trio. Yeah. Um, so maybe um, we're like totally breaking up and leaving our most equipped dudes in the yeah, back. And... So maybe um, switch switch Troy and Raul. So Troy will go with Kirk and Smitty, okay. and um, and Raul will go with the group to the doors. Uh, I don't know. I don't want Troy with us. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> I want the medic. <laughs> <laughs> okay sounds good so Kirk is actually going to search then okay to see if we can get anything to help us pistol why not and then I'll move out one okay what did Kirk do on his first action there <laughs> I don't know trade <laughs> I didn't trade anything no you searched I searched I should have another action, right? Yeah. So I'll come back with you guys for a third action. Yeah, I think I maybe hit it said I was going to move or search already. Okay, okay. so we're done there. Let's let's do some zombie movement here, and then we're going to take a break. Okay. Edit break or a break break? No, oh, whatever. Yeah, those guys move. Spawn some zombies. zombies. Nothing. Nothing. One. One more. Nothing. All okay. right, that's that looking was good. an activation. Good. All right, man. So how are we feeling here? How are we feeling here? Yeah. Taking a little we're break good. here. How are we, we're feeling good. Sorry, we had a little yeah, bit of a, at the beginning of this at this piece. We had a lot of talks. We had to catch up, man. We could talk forever about stuff. So we're loving the chat, man. We're having a lot of fun. Um, do you guys need a break? No, I'm good. Uh, I'm good, but I probably should give uh, this cat some treats. All right, he's going to give the cat some treats, and we're yeah. going to take a break. We'll see you in part two. Okay.